won't believe who's coming to dinner tonight. 117 billion guests, and they're all dead. Every year, millions celebrate Dia de Muertos, the Day of the Dead. Not Halloween, older, Aztec old. A blend of indigenous tradition and Catholic ritual meant to welcome loved ones back for one night. But what if everyone showed up? Roughly 117 billion humans have walked the earth. If they all came tonight, that's 15 ghosts for every living person. And if each ghost only needed an arm's length of space, they'd cover 45,000 square miles, about the size of Bulgaria. Uh, haunted Bulgaria. Need a place to crash? Don't mind cold roommates? And family reunions? Picture your ancestors, their ancestors, and a few confused Neanderthals judging your Spotify wrapped. But Dia de Muertos was never about fear. It's about memory and biology. This might sound wild, but marigolds could literally wake the dead. They release terpenes, compounds, and the same chemical family as citronella. The Aztecs believe they could wake spirits and help them find their way home. And modern science agrees. Those same chemicals trigger olfactory memory in humans too. Even the traditions are hybrid science projects. Sugar skulls? Born from Aztec death masks with European sugar art. Pan de muerto, the bread of the dead. Baked with anise, a spice symbolizing life force. So light a candle, bake the bread, and pray your great grandma's ghost isn't judging your life decisions or asking why her grave is now a parking lot because 